It is time for a science experiment. Charlie from AstroCamp joins me. And what are we talking about today? So one of the things that makes us unique is that we have a whole component of motorsport. And that means that kids get to come to camp and they actually get to drive a go-kart. <gasps> Oh. Yeah, talk about how do you make school fun. Yes. Come to camp and drive a go-kart. Okay. Now along with that, we want to teach them the science behind the internal combustion engine, which is a fascinating machine, especially once you take it apart. Mm -hmm. These devices in front of you are home crafted at Astro Camp. Um, we've taken a uh, ignition source, which is a grill lighter, and we've 3D printed these little devices mm -hmm. to show you how a fuel under compression... Hold on, these are 3D printed? Yeah, these were actually made in camp, designed by uh, one of our instructors. And oh, that's so cool. Now okay. we use them to describe. So this is going to act like our spark plug. Mm -hmm. We are going to have our cylinder here, and we need to apply a fuel. Once we ignite it, we can then see how chemical energy from our fuel mm -hmm. will turn into mechanical energy by launching our tube. Okay. So, so this is all about energy. This is all about energy and that's what our that's what we focus on in our motorsport. We want to show how chemical energy can mm -hmm. become uh, mechanical. So, so you're going to squirt some stuff in there. We're going to get a little bit of fuel in there. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Should we be worried about the fuel? Yeah. Uh-oh. No, that's not. <laughs> okay. Oh no. Oh no. Put that one there. We'll give that a second. So okay. Put a little bit of fuel in this one. <laughs> just open it up. It'll just <laughs> spray right out. Seriously. <laughs> Guess we've got no worries about vapor pressure going on there. Okay. So now we've put some fuel inside. And <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what you just said, but vapor pressure. Yeah. So as this this fuel is volatile, yeah. and as it evaporates, it creates a bit of pressure up top here. Okay. Um, that pressure then pushes down the liquid and puts it. It's pretty it through. That's why you can see oh, it spraying out. Oh, got it. Yeah. Okay. So that's what actually is going to help us here. So okay. with these, we've now put the fuel inside of the chamber. Mm -hmm. As it is as warming up and it's uh, vaporizing, it's creating a bit of pressure in there. Now, what we can do is we're going to take our two poppers. We're going to put our thumb over the top. Okay. Now remember, the red button is how we aim these things. We're going to point straight up mm -hmm. on the count of three. One, two, three. Whoop. Try again a couple times. <laughs> oh no, it's not warm enough. So go ahead and flip it over. Okay. Grab a hold of it. Uh -huh. We're going to use our body heat to warm it up. Because what happened is probably got a little bit of extra in there and it just hasn't quite vaporized just enough. Oh, okay. Yes. So we have to warm it up. Yep. Because so in an engine, when you first start, you have the electrical motor spinning things up and starting to get the compression cycle going okay. and getting the fuel injected into it. And to be honest, gasoline's a little bit more volatile than our fuel here. Okay. So uh, this one takes just a little bit of heat. So that's oh. what we're doing. We're warming it up with our hands. It's so here. interesting how, I mean, science is so dependent on temperature. Temperature, energy, it's all interconnected and yeah. it is incredibly critical, particularly in our experiment right here. Yes. So let's try that again. Are you ready? Okay, ready. All right, three, two, one. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Now you can see that there's a lot of energy stored it in just was a single warm spring. Enough. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So that right there, the chemical, the uh, volatile gas inside, as soon as we sparked it, yeah, boom, it ignited and shot the canister straight up. It and sure that, did. Yeah. Don't worry, everybody's safe. <laughs> Everything's good in here. Oh man, this is so cool. So if somebody wants to learn more about AstroCamp, how can they do that? They can go to our website, www.astrocampva.org. Come check us out. Come try out motorsport. That was so cool. Thank you. <laughs>